Good day to you all. Welcome to another Cancer Rookie. I'm Zach, and that's my head. There it is, in all its purple glory. The singing's not great, and it's kinda hokey. It's time for another Cancer Rookie. Yeah, it's not really that good, yeah. Today we're doing um, Eddie Grant and his uh, the, the song that put him on the map, Electric Avenue. Um, Interesting story about Eddie Grant that I, I read, and I'm assuming this is true. Um, he managed to uh, do a deal with the record company in which he retained all the rights to all of his music, all of it, which is unprecedented um, at the time. Uh, what that meant is I, I guess they didn't have a lot of faith that he was gonna come out with an explosion of hits, um, kind of like he did like uh, Romancing the Stone, remember that? Um, that was a good one of his. He, did, he had a couple of hits like that, but I mean, Electric Avenue especially. I don't think the record company expected it to explode like it did, and he got 100% of the profits off of all of it. Um, incredibly smart businessman, Eddie Grant. Uh, he knows what he's doing. <laughs> and he had a great album, too. This is a great album. And I've always liked this song since I first heard it on the radio, of course, in the early 80s. And everyone likes this song. I mean, come on. It's Electric Avenue. You can't, you can't not like this song. It's, <laughs> it's infectious. It's like a disease. So that's what I'm going to sing today. And uh, hope you enjoy. It's Electric Avenue, Eddie Grant. Electric 
Lake Avenue, and then we take it higher. Hey, we're gonna rock down to Electric Avenue. Oh, yeah! Rock it in the daytime. Rock it in the night. Electric Avenue. So there you have it. Eddie Grant with Electric Avenue. I mean, I may even do another Eddie Grant song. <laughs> he has a bunch of good ones. Um, go look up Romancing the Stone. That's that's a little bit more obscure, but still kind of a hit. And you probably haven't heard it since the 80s. <laughs> Worth listening to again. I did. I've listened to it a bunch of times recently. I was like, man, this is, this is actually pretty good. <laughs> anyway, that's a, another Kansaroki for you. And I will see you next time.